Our Foucault pendulum can teach us a lot about science. Let's dive into the physics that make this seemingly simple object so interesting. In 1851, French physicist Jean Foucault used a pendulum to demonstrate that the Earth rotates, but he did it in a way that non-scientists could understand. But how does it work? Simply put, the pendulum swings on a fixed plane while Earth and the building we're in rotates around this plane. As you look at it, it looks like the pendulum is moving, but we are the ones moving around the pendulum. Think about how the Earth rotates. If we were at the North or South Pole, the pendulum's rotation would take 24 hours. At the equator, it wouldn't rotate at all. Here in Indianapolis, it takes the pendulum about 40 hours to complete a rotation. You might be wondering how it keeps swinging. Let's talk physics. Newton's first law of motion states that an object in motion will stay in motion until acted on by an outside force. That outside force could be gravity, friction from air or the ground, or even bumping into another object. In this case, we are working against air resistance. At the very top of the cable is an electromagnet. It gives the pendulum an extra boost that makes up for the lost energy thanks to friction, gravity, and even road vibrations. Without the electromagnet, it would swing in shorter arcs until it came to a complete stop. Remember, while it looks like the pendulum itself is moving in a circle to knock down the pegs, it is us and the ground that moves around it and brings the pegs to the pendulum to be knocked down. Next time you visit, check it out for yourself.